Hey, Sausage Sleuths, it's me, the number one Sausage Sleuth, Joe. Welcome back to Nancy Drew. Stay tuned for Donger. Who's Donger? <laughs> well, we won't have to, to find out very long from now because we did already get blowed up in the first episode. And in fact, I did leave myself a hint because I played this a week ago. And my save file says you got to wait until 6, which means I need to wait until 6 p.m. to go to the prop room. Right now it's 3 o'clock. To go to the prop room so that I can sneak around and get whatever I need to disarm the bomb. That's right. In fact, the danger is the bomb. And also the wax animatronics that seem to have taken over the entire place. I don't, I shouldn't click on that door again because I will get blowed up. And wildly enough, I have not soft locked the game yet. Times are wild here, and you better believe it that I know my way around this place. Oh, <laughs> it's the same door. Wait. Yeah, I go this. Uh oh. No, 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 we're good, we're good. So I really do need to... I can't come in after dark. I literally can't come in af into, after dark, so I literally have to just wait until... Oh, chat. I shouldn't have started the VOD yet, because this is about to be boring. It's you again. What do you want? Oh, I'm sorry for bothering you. I'll leave right away. Is you there do any that. time... Is there any way that I can make time go faster so I am not so bored right now? What time is it in the game? It's 3.15. Yeah, when you're an extra, you just get to run around the studio. We're not really here today for a long time. We're, I mean, for a fun time. We're here for a long time. So I really have to wait? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Dear chat. Sleep IRL and you'll skip time. Dear dear chat, is there a way to make time go faster? Y'all can y'all can tell me. Yeah, come on, y'all can tell me. You can tell your old pal Joe. <laughs> but if I sleep at the hotel, I can't get back in here. Check the magazines and stuff in the Oh, there's magazines in the lobby. Why didn't anyone say so? I love a highlights magazine. Can oh I hey bud. You? Hello, here's my pass. Hello, Ms. Drew. Thank you, you may proceed. Thanks, bud. But I actually didn't want to go in here. Oh, looks like I have to. So I will turn around slowly once again. Hey, bud. There, uh, dear chat, there's no magazines in the lobby. Oh, the other are. Interview, L-O-H-C, star. A clue! Someone, in fact, that I know of right now is that someone here has been making the letters out of the magazines, which we already knew it was someone involved. Not the humans. Yeah, they cut out the letter. Does Nancy not have anything to say about this? No, she doesn't find that suspicious. She's fine with that, in fact. Well, that was a clue, for sure. Marketing department, human resources, and I can't go up the stairs, unfortunately. My pass seems to limit me to down here. Okay, that took thir- Oh, that took 30 minutes. If you stay in the lobby too late, you won't be able to get- So I need to be past the lobby. You know what? I'm going to do it. Hey, taxi! Where to, lady? 7226 Lexington Avenue, please. On my way! Wait a minute. Is that the voice actor from the hit video game America's Next Top Model it's for locked. the Nintendo Wii? It's locked. Was that the hit voice actor from... <laughs> Wait, is Nancy's voice actor the same... Voice actor from the hit game, 
America's next top model for the Nintendo Wii? There's only morning and night. I don't think I can set an alarm in this game, can I? I think there's just morning and night. Oh, no, yeah, there's just day and night. It's all day and night to Nancy. Taxi. Well, we'll just, I'll just yeah, drive I'll around for a little bit. 318 West 10th Street, please. I'm gonna soft lock if I don't wait in the studio. No. Taxi! Where can I take you today, miss? 1999 Broadway, please. No. It's fine. Can I help you? Hello, here's my pass. Hello, it's Ms. Fine. Drew. What time is it now? Thank you. You may proceed. It is four. <gasps> Holy shit. How did we get from lower Manhattan to upper Manhattan in zero minutes in a taxi? Um, I don't know. What other... Go look at the set. Okay. I don't know where I am. Oh. Did someone... Is someone dead in there? Now remember, if we'll all remember this, I'm sure we will. I want to pick up the fucking wire cutters. <laughs> Now, if this were me and I were the detective on this case, I've already stolen a screwdriver. As you can see. I'm not sure why I don't just also steal the wire cutters, because they are for cutting wires. Um, I have a question. So, y we can backseat, uh, briefly. I appreciate y'all. Um... I'll do a dear chat. Dear chat, do I really just have to wait? Is this just now waiting until... Oh, the time just changed. It's 4.30. So I do, I just have to wait. Well, y'all remember, y'all remember this hole, right? This was, um... Oh yeah, I got this one right, and then y'all told me I couldn't do it yet. The game, I, even though I did it, it, I couldn't do it yet. You don't remember having to wait? You got a letter? You have to wait because it's the only way you can get back into the prop room and get the wire cutters. Okay. I can't get in after it's nighttime, so I just need to... So literally, it's me... Hiding... Screaming, pissing, and crying behind the scenes until they finally let me. Oh, oh! Can I help you? Hello, here's my pass. I'm just giving y'all a Drew. little. Thank the letter you. You with the proceed. code? I haven't gotten a letter with the code. There's a way. Oh, there is a way to get in after nighttime, but not until after the bomb. You can get in after nighttime on the side and just, but I need a code. I don't have the code. So I literally just have to wait here. Well, that's fine. That gives us stuff hey, to Brooklyn. talk about. That just gives us so much to talk Hello, about, Hello, young lady. I should get back to the set. Goodbye. Don't take any wooden nickels, young lady. Okay. So we've got another hour and 15 minutes to kill, kill, and not Carol Channing. Um, so like, how are y'all doing in life? Do y'all have any trauma to dump on me today? Can I go visit Maddie? This one's Maddie's, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's open. Have you found anything out yet? No, not yet. Yeah, I should get back to learning my lines for tomorrow. Good luck. That killed no time. So... Oh, yeah, what are some other um, Nancy Drew voiced uh, shows? 
Ooh, leaving for Maine and New Hampshire. That sounds like fun. Not this, Ryan. Not today. Not this news today. <laughs> Not this news today that I'm just hearing about. Who else can I bother? Yeah, there's like senior portraits all over the walls. It's very confusing. She And she leaves at six, we said. Oh, the, the hit video game Diablo? There's what on set I could... There's one thing on set I could see. Okay, I like a mystery. Just need a spiral. Oh. It does make me swipe every time. I need something to make this work. There's a gnat. The gnats are doing better, though. Oh, yeah, she does voice some characters in Skyrim, huh? Uh, Y'all can just tell me what it... Like, dear chat, what it, what can I see on set? Y'all can just tell me, because I did the clock thing. And at this point, it's kind of like... You know, when a game makes you wait this long... There's not even a dead body back here. Under the table... So, this table? Not this table. The other table. Um, hey, Madeline! Well, now I gotta figure out how to turn around. This table? Oh, very interesting that that would be there. That is a broken vice. Thank you for... So, but I couldn't even pick it up. She doesn't even have anything to say about it? I, saw, I did see the teleprompter. Well, I saw one of their teleprompters. I saw this one. Unless there's like a cord or something I missed. But I read that. We could talk about who did it, but I think there's still someone I haven't met, isn't there? Oh, save. Okay. Should I click second chance? What if I clicked load and we had to... <laughs> we had to wait all this time again. Wouldn't that be so funny? I don't know if I saw the, the light. Because I don't know where it was. I can't really look down, can I? Wouldn't that be funny if I clicked new game? It's 5.30. We got 30 more minutes. That would be... That is so me. <laughs> uh, that would be... That is so me. Do you know what I mean? No, I don't think I ever saw the light on the floor because I can't look down. And I think they cleaned it up, right? No, that's like the old Joe. <laughs> yeah, I, I like the environment. It's a pretty environment. I love the environment. Oh, environment, love. Oh, the environment? Love. I keep thinking that's a person. That's what people look like in my mind. That's what my body looks like in the mirror. <laughs> Three legs, stick thin, and then a big old, then a big old head. Big, big old basketball up there at the top. Bet. <laughs> Bet. This is a good opportunity to look around. I like looking at things. Y'all? Hey, chat. Do y'all like looking at things? Do 
Chat, what do y'all think about looking at things? Thoughts? What? <laughs> hey, it's six o'clock! Okay, time to do one thing. Did it open? Oh, it opened. I think props is this way. I'll save the game. Y'all calm down. I'll save it before I go into the prop room, even. Look at me. I never save the game this often. I need something to make this work. I need something to make this work. I need something to make this work. Wait, they take the fuck it. Oh, re see, remember. They take the doorknobs off of the doors at night. You can just lock the door. You can just lock the door. You don't have to take the doorknob. Every time I walk piggy, I always unscrew the doorknob. <laughs> All right, anyway. Um, and also, dear chat, y'all can give me a hint about where to get something that cuts shit. Because, quite frankly, I thought I looked all over this... This flop of a place, and I didn't see nothing. So y'all give me... Y'all feel free to give me... Look for a map. Oh, I did find the map in the... There was a map in the trunk, wasn't there? There was something in the trunk, but I don't remember what it was. I just like playing with the lock. It's hidden very well. So I already did this. And that's how I got the key. It's hidden very well. Oh, there's a map. Oh, and there's all the letters around it, too. Is there something under the map? <laughs> Wait, just one fucking second. There was a pair of wire cutters. All you could see was the littlest red piece of shit. Well, I tried to read this, but I couldn't read it. It says, when gate... When gates are locked and paths are blocked, the then look for the ways... Oh, I can't read upside down. Then look for the ways that... Something. Yeah, something. So I got to over here. Can does uh dear chat, can anyone read upside down? Not hey Macarena. Turn it upside down. I can't do that. Click on the one oh, so this actually tells me to click on the pixel, the red pixel. The answer lies beneath... The oh. And that's where my eyes were beneath? Okay. Well, I, pre I, I do appreciate that. I do appreciate y'all. Thank you so much. Thank you, Chad. It's you again. What do you want? I thought you might be interested to know that I found a light clamp on the set. It looked as if it had been sawed off. That was no accident on the set. It was a deliberate attempt on Rick's life. Well, it looks like we've got ourselves a little Miss Sherlock Holmes on the set. Look, we didn't hire you to play junior detective, so don't be sticking your nose where it doesn't belong, okay? Well, I'll let you get back to your business. I got blowed up. Goodbye. Yeah. Was that... That wasn't Nancy, was it? Was that Nancy reading that line? 
It didn't sound like Nancy. Yeah, people got some twitchy eyebrows in this game. Is she still here? It's open. Have you found anything out yet? No, not so yet. We're not yeah, telling her about the clamp. Get back to learning my lines for tomorrow. Good luck. Girl. Okay, let's save it. That was so fun. That was so fun how we had to wait so long. Okay, there's a bomb in here. Hello? Ha 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 ha. Oh my god. And we click the screwdriver every time. Do I not just click it in whenever I want to? Hello? Is there a thing that tells me? Well, we'll try it again. This will probably take me a few tries. And then I'll get really... I can already tell how this is going to go. I'm going to get really fucking annoyed that I have to keep taking the screws off the fucking thing. Oh, I should save it. Oh, I have an idea. Don't worry about it. Load up. Save that one there. I got a lot of save games. If you try to save it here, you'll soft lock it. <laughs> That's okay. So if I were gonna cut a wire... Now there must be an order. Don't cut the blue wire first. Let's see what happened. No, this is great. This is fine. Oh, I'm holding the screwdriver. The cover is on too tight. <laughs> the screwdriver's missing. I don't have the screwdriver anymore. The cover is on too tight. Yeah, don't, don't worry. I, this is exactly why I made uh, two, two different save games. You can lose an item. Wait, if you're holding an item when you save the game, you lose it? Hello? Should I get a Coke out of the fridge first? Should I get a Coke out of the fridge? Wait, we could stop. We could get rid of pollution if we just... Oh. I just want to cut the speaker wires because it's so fucking loud. I guess I would probably cut the orange wire first because I hate orange. Because I hate orange. All right, dear chat. How do I know which wire to cut first? There's a... I have to listen to the message. There's a message? I don't have time for that. What did it say? 
There's a hint in Maddie's room that I can't access anymore. Yeah, you'll just tell me at this point. There's four wires, and I don't want to have to do this four times, four times, four times, four times. I paused the game at this point. It's over for me. Why? R-O-B. Thank you so much. I really do appreciate that. I'm tired of getting blowed up. I am dead ass tired of getting blowed up. You kind of have to cut beside the wire, huh? Oh, I can't spend 10 seconds on each wire, mama. Seven seven three four. Should I type? Should I memorize that number? I, t I memorized it. It was pretty scary for a minute there. And then what happened? Once Who the I fuck is this? Bomb and got out of there. I called the police, and I was stuck at the station for hours. They searched the dressing room oh, and sent the bomb off to the crime lab. Oh, but I get it. They didn't find anything. Oh, and remind me to thank Chief McGinnis when I get back home. He vouched for me when I asked for a copy of the tape. It sounds like things have gotten way out of control. This oh, is Ned. Ned. I've got another call. It's probably the police. I love you, and I promise I'll be careful. Call you later, okay? Okay. Hello, Ms. Drew. This is Bill Pappas, the producer for Light of Our Love. I just wanted to thank you for your quick thinking and valiant efforts today. I understand that you've been detained at the police department. I blew up like seven times. Yes, I was. They needed a statement from me. What type of information? Um, confidential. I'm sorry, but I need to keep that confidential. You'll need to ask the police about that. Nancy. Can I call you Nancy? I hate to be blunt <laughs> about this. That's my fucking we name. We can't allow anyone to just walk into people's dressing rooms. Oh my god, read him. Perhaps you should enforce better security then. What? Hey. Ever since Rick started getting threats, we've taken every measure to ensure his safety. We've even hired more security after that Sis, accident in the studio. I stood in the hallway till 6 o'clock and then used my own doorknob to get into the fucking room. So I don't know what kind of dead-ass security you think you have. Can you answer some questions I have? Uh, no. I'm very busy at the moment. But seeing what you did today, I guess I owe you one. Holy you shit. Okay, let's Can get you started. Think of anyone on the staff who has skills in explosives or electronics? We definitely do not use explosives on our set. We use outside pyrotechnicians for location shoots. And of course, all of our technical crew are very knowledgeable about electronics. This is the most boring but voice. I couldn't picture any of them making a bomb. And he's just kind of mumbling. Are there many his temporary lines. employees working at the studio? Yes, but all of our employees, either temps or yes. permanent, are highly qualified and come from the best agencies. We don't hire just anyone, and we carefully screen our well, employees. Well, he had one Bud Light. This is me. This voice actor is me after one Bud Light. Well, um, what are the... Do you believe someone from outside the studio could have done this? That's impossible. That's this impossible. set has been closed down tight since That's that accident. Down I even accident. hired extra security. I am My own mother security. couldn't have gotten in here. My own mother couldn't have gotten in here. Is there video surveillance of the dressing room? Uh, we're currently uh, working we're with the police on that. But there are no security cameras in the dressing room. There's no security cameras in the dressing room. Who, besides Rick, would have keys to his dressing room? Only Rick and the security personnel. We've already checked into this. Rick yeah, well, is very touchy about this room. I won't even let the janitors Rick clean it unless he's there. And, uh, about his room. I won't even let the janitors clean it unless he's there. That's odd. Has he always been this way? Yes, Rick's very controlling like that. Yes, he's, he's it took us weeks to renegotiate man. his contract. Yes, he had contract. all of these detailed demands, like about <laughs> lighting, script direction, the placement of his Why name. Why take in this? He's unbearable at times. He's Listen, unbearable. I need to get back to work. I need Do you need anything else? Are there many people who have access to the studio at night? Bye, Jenna. I'm glad you got to be here. Managers have access, and of course, myself and Lillian. But we've often got projects going on around the clock. Post-production work and set design, to name a few. Can I have a list of everyone who's been in the studio at night? That's confidential. Do you have surveillance video of the hallways, perhaps? We're looking into that. Listen, we run a studio down here, not a prison. Sometimes staffers borrow the security videos when they run out. 
What? You addressed this problem before, and I can guarantee it won't happen again. Hold on a second. People, no, wait, wait, wait. Tell Anyone? Him call him. Don't put him on hold. I'll call him. Anyone can just take the security videos? Hello? Then it's not security videos. That's not what a security video is. Who takes care of the teleprompter? Well, in theory, it's the lead scriptwriter's job to manage that part of production. But a lot of actors, especially Maddie, like to edit their script to add emphasis. Uh-oh, Maddie. And also the lipstick. Is Ms. Strathorn the lead scriptwriter? No, not at all. She's always submitting scripts and story ideas to our writers. That's the prop. They never room, go anywhere. Lady. My does the studio God. have any audio mixing equipment? Of course, of course it does. We, do. we have a whole department set up for audio recording. And we also have some does, mixers in the control room. When you film TV show, do you edit the audio? Do you think I can see them sometime? Will you change we're my diaper? We're busy with production right now. We're no longer conducting tours. If you... Oh, hold on. No. Get someone else for that. We need to have someone on standby if he decides to leave. Nancy said... Is the Sorry soap opera real or is it scripted? Is the soap opera the same thing as a documentary? Who else has access to the <laughs> staff offices? The usual people, <laughs> janitors, some assistants, Explanation point Millie, up time. security. Now, is there anything else you need to ask of me? I'm in a bit of a hurry. Well, thank you for your help in this matter, Mr. Pappas. Goodbye. Yes, well. Thanks again for your brave efforts today. Is the stuff that Goodbye. happens on my TV always real? Or is someone writing it? Today on Sesame Street, I learned the number four. We'll save this one. I'm gonna call Bess. Don't worry, we're doing it all. Don't worry. Have I passed all the soft locks at this point? Elmo told me where my Mrs. nose Bass. is. Hi, Bess. It's Nancy. Nancy, tell me everything. Did you get Rick's autograph for me? He's so gorgeous. It must be so exciting to be on the set with all those stars. George filled me in on everything that's happened, so tell me who the suspects are. I can't believe someone would do this to Rick. Really? Rick? Everyone hates Rick. If I'm being honest, I think everyone in the studio is doing something to him. Even him. Even him! You know, it just might be Rick who's this behind is... these threats. No way, Nancy. Why would he send death threats to himself? I think he did the Get magazine real. stuff. He's trying to blame someone else. I think he started as it a publicity stunt. It could be a publicity stunt. stunt. I know He's Rick has a reputation himself. for being a practical joker, but I'd think he'd get enough publicity by just being cute. So, who are the other suspects? That's her type. Bess's type. This is Bess's type. Yeah, I would think Murder on the Orient Express type situation. Um... But every single person on set seems to hate him for some reason. Let's see. There's this odd woman who's the prop master. That must be Millie Strathorn. Did you know she owns the entire network and it's worth millions? She's a total cat lover. I heard she treats her cats like royalty. So who are the other suspects? Maddie is really nice, but I can't rule her out. Oh my well, gosh. Well, someone did the bomb Wouldn't though. Wouldn't it be weird if Maddie was behind it all? What if Maddie really had a secret motive to get rid of Rick? Like Marlena on Crimson Cove last year. So I think that, so th I think there's gonna be one big bad, big bad sad who did the bomb. And I feel like everyone else is just kind of bullying him. Which is fair. <laughs> no, I'm against bullying. I don't think so, Bess. Real life isn't a soap opera, you know. So, who are the other suspects? The producer doesn't Everyone exactly hates like him. Rick, but I've yet to meet him in person. Who's the producer now? Is it William Pappas? Worldwide just hired him like six months ago to improve their ratings. 
Crimson Cove is really beating Light of Our Love. Oh shit, soap opera drama. There's the director, Lillian Weiss, who's not a very happy camper. Oh yeah, Chatter Magazine had a whole spread on their breakup at some elegant restaurant. She dumped a whole pitcher of water on Rick's head. I just, y'all know this about me. I, I hate celebrity worship so much that... Everything Bess is saying right now wants me to smash the phone with a fucking hammer. I loathe celebrity worship. Lillian and Rick dated? Mm-hmm. I think they started dating once he got onto the show. So the producers They always show up at these Hollywood premieres dating. together. Okay, I'll be off in a minute. Nancy, I gotta go soon. So who else have you met? My agent, Dwayne Powers, is pretty cool, but let's just say he's not one of Rick's number one fans. Never heard of him. It's so funny to hear you say my agent. So how did you hook up with him? <gasps> not hook up with him. Really? I thought you would have heard of how really? famous I am. I thought you would have heard of him. <laughs> I'm not that much of a fan. But I know about most of the major agencies soap operas use, and I've never heard of any Dwayne Powers. Okay, Mom, I'll be right down. Nancy, I gotta go. Give me a call later if you need some help, okay? Bye. So, let's just get this straight. Have I avoided the lockings? Have I avoided all the soft locks yet? Let me, let me just say this. Oh, call Bess now? What's stuck? I'm naming this one okay. What's stuck? <laughs> Not, um. <laughs> well, we don't know. That's fine if we don't know. 2583. Who did I call last time? Well, she knows Nancy didn't get hired this because of her Fane. talent. After the tone, please leave your name, phone number, and a brief message. Thanks. George, come get your cousin. Oh, made out. Who's Dwayne? Oh, my agent. Do I have an address book? I don't know his number. How do I call Dwayne? Did I... Did I write down his number last week? I mean, I didn't. Did y'all write down his number? Oh, it's on the map? What's a map? Oh, my map. Well, I have to go outside to use the map. Excuse me, I need to use the little maps room. 212, 5 times 3, 2900. I can only read my map when I'm outside. It's and, locked. And then, in fact, I lock, I always lock the door behind me. I stand out on the street and I scream. And then I come back in and I call my agent. Lock the door, unscrew the knob, exactly. Chemtrails. Well, I have to see how many chemtrails are outside. We're sorry, your call cannot be completed as dialed. Please check the number and dial again. Did I not dial it right? Recording. Oh, wait. Oh. Oh, I don't need to dial the 212. I live it. I'm in New York. Maybe he's dead. I mean... You've reached the powers agency. Interviews are only taken by appointment. Thank you. He has a good voice. Did I... Did I say he had a bad voice in the last episode? I can't keep track of my own feelings, by the way. <laughs> Just so y'all know, I can't keep track of my own feelings, so... Conflicted. Alright, I'll call him during the day. Now, did I get a letter? 
due to the recent safety concern, the side entry code 3689. How many of y'all's pin numbers did I just expose live on camera? 3689. Um, sorry, I need to be keeping up with these at the same time. Not all of this. Not all of this. I've missed some of these. B Brock, thank you for the bits. I appreciate that. Voodoo Sparkle Juju, thank you for the nine months. GG Tastic, not crab salad. Thank you for the bits. American Teen Against Crime, and we love to hear it. Thank you so much for the five months. Uh, Mayor of Fartville, thank you for the three months. Great to have you here. I appreciate that. Powers Agency. How may I help you? Hi, Mr. Powers. It's Nancy Drew. Ah, Ms. Drew. Maddie told me all about the bomb you defused. What a stroke of luck you were passing by. With Rick's dressing room right next to Maddie's. Hey, Ragtag McGee, killed. welcome. Oh, yeah, I defused that bomb. I think Rick was in more danger than Maddie. Thank you. Is nothing really. Have you met the prop master at Worldwide? We're getting to the point. She seems rather strange. Yes, I've met Millie once or twice. She's very eccentric, actually owns a studio, but chooses to stay locked up in that prop room of hers. Rumor has it that she's trying to write Rick Arlen out of the show. Ooh. I'm afraid that I'm not making a very good impression on Lillian. She doesn't seem to like me very much. The Lillian I don't and Rick see why dated. she would. Lillian is very professional, though I think she doesn't care for Maddie very much. Who would? I, they're all unlikable. Have you noticed how... Dear chat, have y'all noticed how unlikable everybody is? <laughs> Why doesn't she like Maddie? I'm not sure, but without a doubt, it has something to do with Rick. Oh, probably because Maddie he and Rick dated. Creating trouble. Maddie and Rick dated, and then Lillian dated Rick? How does he enjoy creating trouble? When I worked with Rick at the Belfry, he was always playing off of people's weaknesses, starting rumors and fights. He always seemed to prey on the most gullible people. He's a bully. That's what a bully is. Um, Brittany May, thank you for the bit. Oh, are you having a fungus nap problem too? It's the move. Thank you. I hope yours clears up. Petty Broccoli, thank you for the 14 months. Do you know how I can get I into the control that. Great room to at the see studio? You. Are you interested in stage managing? I'd be happy to talk to you about this subject. I used to be quite a whiz at it myself. Lillian has the entrance code, but I see no reason why you'd need to get up there. I would like what to go up there. What do threats against Rick? Maddie's very concerned about them. I don't believe them. Rick was always known for his odd sense of humor and practical jokes. Unfortunately, Maddie always fell for them, just like she's doing now. The producer seems pretty upset lately. He's always yelling. Oh, he's just blowing off steam. Rick's recent threats about leaving the show have put an undue amount of pressure on him. Upper management seems to fear that the ratings will fall if Rick leaves. <gasps> Although I really can't picture that since Maddie is the real star of Light of Our Love. Well, I should get back to the set. Thanks for your help. Maddie you is the in. real star? I'd like to know how things are working out at Worldwide. So we need to get the code from Lillian. Lily. <laughs> Why did I say that sentence so weird? So, we need to get... The call from Lelion. Swedish. Taxi! Where can I take you today, miss? Speaking a bad Broadway, accent. Please. Just hopping in the taxi with our Irish taxi driver. Can I help you? Hello, here's my pass. Lelion. Oh, Drew. Thank you. You may proceed. All right. Who can I yell at today? Who am I going to throw hands at today? I can never go in Will Papa's room. It's open. Oh, Nancy, I'm so glad that you're okay. Everyone's been talking about that bomb scare. Rick's still shrugging it off, but I can tell he's upset about it. Did Lillian We're and Rick getting date into after it. you both broke up? Yeah, Rick had been after Lillian for a while, pretty much to meet her film friends from out west. Uh oh. I warned her about Rick, but she didn't listen. Now she bears a grudge against me. 
Why does she hate you? Why doesn't she hate Rick? Let's all hate Rick. I hate Rick. I shouldn't. I regret defusing the bomb. Rick's pretty good at loving and leaving them. What a... Oh, that part. Rick's pretty good at loving and leaving them. What a loser. Rick's what not a like loser. that. At least he wasn't with me. Everyone has this idea that he dumped me, but it wasn't at all like that. He had a lot of trouble dealing with the pressures of his career and a relationship Stop at the same Stop apologizing for this man. He saw it happening and agreed to split up. Rick's a wonderful guy. I have no regrets. She... She has live, laugh, love signs. She has a tattoo that says no regrets. She is... Well, I'll see you later, Maddie. Yeah, I should get back to learning my lines for tomorrow. People Good like luck. that, we just gotta let her... You can't stop her from self-sabotaging. Entrez-vous. My hero, <laughs> Nancy Drew. You know, according to ancient tradition, if someone saves your life, you I should serve them for them. the rest of your life. So, what can I do for you, young lady? Your wish is my command. Yeah, right. Well, you can tell me if you've noticed any suspicious characters around your dressing room lately. Sorry to yes, this I man. Have. They're named Agent Harris, Officer Josewitz, and Detective Bonnet. It appears I've been quite a celebrity with the local authorities. Hey, I hear Detective Beach is looking for a new star. Do you think I should do some research with my new friends to land the part? What's the story with the prop what master? What is the story with Why the prop master? Why does she hate master? you? Old Millie Strathorn, heir to the worldwide broadcast. That's a pretty good impression. Portion. She's great, except for the fact that she's never liked me. She thinks I'm too big for my britches, and that That's I a good impression. wouldn't know a good thing if it came up to me and stuck its finger in my nose. Okay, maybe he should do impressions for a living. Can I ask your advice? Dwayne Powers is my agent. He's pretty good, isn't he? Dwayne's a loser, babe. Don't tell me he's representing you. Is that so bad? Didn't he represent you? Didn't he represent you? Yes, he did. A very long time ago. I was young and naive, just like you, love. I made a mistake. Something you can't this afford to gross. do at this point in your career. This is gross how he's talking to me, right? Babe and love and darling and all of this garbage. So tell me, Rick. Who haven't you dated on Light of Our Love? Oh, you've got quite a reputation on this set. <laughs> Whatever anyone's saying, I can guarantee that it's all wrong. I swear. I'm just misunderstood, that's all. Who is Millie? <laughs> Wait, Millie the prop person? So, you've never dated Millie? Nah, Millie hates me. Did I tell you she's been trying to write me out of the show ever since I got on board? I don't know why. Luckily, owning the company doesn't mean you can work as Not script this. Writer. So, you've never dated Maddie? Oh, come on. Everyone knows about Maddie and me. The perfect match made in soap opera land. It was too weird dating her and playing the role on stage. I just had to figure out what was real and Not what, what was, was just real. an act, you know? I sometimes think, if I can only get out of being Rory Danner, maybe she can get out of being Serena Livingston. What about Lillian? Lillian's a nobody. <gasps> she was always after me, and things were breaking up between Maddie and me. It was just a rebound romance. I know, I've Good got this God. bad reputation as being some kind of I gotta Casanova, go. but everyone's got a second chance, you know? I just wish sometimes I could go back in time, just wake up and find it was just a dream and start all over. I wouldn't be known as Rick the Slick then. Listen, I gotta go, Rick. Be careful, okay? Ciao, Bella. I wish I could. I wish I could go to sleep and wake up and this had been had been all a dream as well. And this had been all a dream also as well. Let's go talk to Lilia. Let's get yelled well, at some well, more. Well, well. I see our local hero has shown up for work. Not only can she waste everyone's time with prying questions, but she can find the time to save Rick from being blown to smithereens. <laughs> me? Little old me. Can I ask your advice on something? She hates Rick's me. really been flirty with me. Should I take him seriously? <laughs> I think Rick's completely out of your league, but he'll flirt with any skirt. Not any skirt. Huh. 
Well, if you were good enough for him, <gasps> then why shouldn't I be? Listen, you don't know a thing about Rick and me. He used me to meet my friends from L.A. to try and schmooze his way into films. All along, I thought he really loved me. He just walked all over me. This is delicious. It really is. The drama? Well, it's drama that I don't really care about, and I'm also not involved Maddie in. I'm not apologizing for that, by what the way. What business is it of hers if you date Rick or not? You know, she used to beg me not to go out with Rick. She was pathetic. If you ask Who, me, Maddie? she's totally lovesick with that guy. I think well, y'all are all I'll pathetic. Let you get back to your business. You do that. Don't sell yourself short. Y'all are all pathetic. Y'all are all pathetic. Why, hello. I hear you've become quite the celebrity, saving Rory Dunner from those diabolical traps set by oh, the Oh, no. She thinks he's his soap girl. opera person. Thank goodness you had my wire cutters. Else you would have been blown all the way to Bakersfield. Don't you mean Rick Arlen? And who is Yuri? No. I mean Rory Danner, young lady. Not Yuri this. Yuri is Rory's evil twin. He's always trying to so, bump off okay. Rory. With his brother out of the way, Yuri thinks he'll have a clear I have some shot at we have, Serena. The I motives are being heavily him, laid upon us. Up in Jackson's Wharf. That Rory Danner needs to be taught a lesson. So, the they are laying on the motives thick. Okay. Everybody has a motive. Even Maddie. Every single... So hers is, she thinks the soap opera's real, blah, 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 trying to get rid of him, trying to write him off the show, trying to write him off of life. Millie, date... First of all, they shouldn't name one character Millie and one Maddie. That's just confusing. The producer dated him and hates him. I don't know what Maddie's deal is. And Dwayne hates him, too. They all hate him. I should get back to the set. Goodbye. Have a good day. <laughs> I think Nancy did it. They're really laying it on thick. All right, let's get back. Let's go to the set and see what the drama is on set today. Oh, are they not filming today? The set is useless today. I don't even have the code to get upstairs. So maybe now that I have the night code, I should come back at night. And I'll I'll do some snooping. I'll break into some things. Um, Kit Kat Moss, thank you for the bits, by the way. Nico, thank you for the 28 freaking months. I appreciate that. It's good to see you. I'm doing good. Kit Kat Moss, thank you so much. The one red pixel. I saw it. I think I'll go visit Dwayne, actually. Taxi! Yeah, what's the address? Oh, Anonymous West with the gift sub. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Havana 5 -0, thank you for the six months. Oh, it's great to have you here. It's locked. God. It's so hard to... Not this. Is he ever in his office again? Do I have a prediction about the culprit? I think they've all done something to Rick. I don't know who did the bomb. Because that's obviously the most serious thing. But I don't... It's locked. Hey, taxi! Where to, lady? 7226 Lexington Avenue, please. On my way! Do I want us to answer that? Um, it's loud. Yeah, I know. I can't do anything about it. <laughs> what, 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 did the, what was the question I asked? Can I get into... No, never mind. Never mind. I don't want y'all to answer anything. Katie Cutie, thank you for the six months! I appreciate it's that! Locked. Oh, I got to unlock the door. Thank you so much. And for the bits as well. I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, I'm sneaking out at night to do a murder. Taxi. Where can I take you today, miss? 1999. Yes, thank you for the bits. Oh my God, I hope you're doing okay now. 
Slow toe jam, thank you for the six months. Yeah, what are wooden nickels? So I see the I see the back entrance. I just want to see if there's anything else I can click. Nope. Three six eight nine. I need something to make this work. Just like a doorknob? I need something to make this work. I don't have keys. I need something that is a to make problem. this work. Oh, we need to go to the audio editors, too. And this is Maddie's. I need something to make this work. I need something to make this work. I mean, girl. I need something to make this work. Got it. I got it. We need something to make that work. And in fact, they're gonna see that I entered the set, aren't they? I don't need to be. Here. I would have thought the screwdriver, but it doesn't let me. It never lets me use the screwdriver to open doors, or it hasn't yet. I need something to make this work. We can try. I need something to make this work. I need something to make this work. So what we in fact need is a key. We need a key to open everything. Now here, though, I do have my own doorknob. I do bring my own doorknob everywhere. Do you think that she would have a key behind the desk? But I don't remember her having one. And then also... Not the saddest bagpipes in the world. Yeah, you put a doorknob knob on a doorknob. When you... That's how you break open a door, is you put a doorknob on top of a doorknob, and then you can open the door. How did I get over here? I thought it was on the other side of the desk. Well, so this was pretty useless. Oh, unless I can steal... Oh, wow. So they locked down the fucking entrance. Don't worry, y'all. I have at least several ideas, hey, if taxi. not one. Door, lady? In, if not Lexington Avenue, exactly On one... It's locked. ...idea that I have right now. Surely Maddie has keys. Suffocate Maddie in her sleep. Shave off her head. Become Maddie. Open the... Get into the place. Open the door. I already read this one. God. She is so narcissistic. <laughs> She is so, I don't even know how to close it. No. The, the amount that I don't care about Maddie enough to open her fucking mail. If Maddie's in trouble, I don't want to know about it. It's not my business. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Is this a secret? <laughs> Did I Wait, did I open this already? I just found a secret compartment. Rick, there's so much I want to tell you. Did I already find this? I am ready for this commitment. Oh. I don't care about this. Not this time. The rose is thought of love. I can't read this fucking Victorian ass looking shit. Dearest Maddie, I love you. God, kill me. No words, something. I'm not reading love letters today. Send an email. You know? What the fuck is this? 
It's locked. Oh. It's locked. Well, hold on. It's locked. It's locked. Yeah. Hold on. It's locked. Okay. I think that drawer is locked, though. November 13th. That's the day we're gonna kill him. Where does she keep her keys? Why does she only allow me in one room in this house? you think they'd be in this drawer, but I can't open the drawer. Man, she really shopped at the most... She shopped at Kirkland's. Girl, Maddie's entire... Maddie decorated her whole fucking house at Kirkland's. Just like my mom. Not try the doorknob on the drawer. Girl, she went to Kirkland's. Just like my mom did. Oh, dear chat, when is Dwayne Powers in his office? Wait, the game removed the key? What, did I save the game while holding the key or something? Not is 323. So I never see him again. And we never saw him again. <laughs> oh, you can only get the key via cheats. Okay. Just call other people and someone until someone lets you in and then break into his office. Is that a thing that I can actually do? Taxi. Yep, we'll do yeah, that. What's then. The address? 318 West 10th Street, please. You got it. Who am I friends with? Yes. Not Aileen. We'll try this time. Not Autumn's interiors. Not today, thank you. It's gonna be the last one I click. Fair. This is annoying when people do this to you. Hello? Can Nancy not reply? They're answering the phone, Nancy. Oh, I can't get in yet. Not Ella's hand service. I skipped some, but I can't do it now anyway, though. Is that what y'all are saying? Well, it won't let me click all of them. Yes. Nancy just doesn't reply. That's better than her... Oh, I have to do it at night. Oh. Alright, hey, I'm going taxi. back to sleep. Where to, lady? 7226 Lexington Avenue, please. On my way! This, yeah, this definitely... I'm going to sleep. Oh, someone will be waiting for pizza. Okay, that's good to know. This is why, in our building, you have to go down and meet the person. Taxi! Yeah, what's the address? Because of people like Nancy. West 10th Street, please. You got it. It's locked. Now, who would order pizza? Probably Aileen. Yes. 
is your pizza from New York City. I just drove here from the Bronx. My family lives in Queens, and I have some cousins in Brooklyn. Did I mention that my great-grandfather was Italian? Not today, thank you. It's about time you showed up. I've been waiting 45 minutes for that pizza. <laughs> I don't bet. I bet you I can't even dead ass get in the store. I need something to make this work. I need something to make this work. I need something to make this dead work. Dead ass. What about oil? I need something to make this work. I have something. No, I don't want a hint yet. If you just tell me that I have something, that's good. To, that's good enough for me. I can figure it out from here. Thank you. I need something to make this work. Oh, I thought that was the door hinges. I was going to take off the door hinges. Try literally everything? Okay. Oh my god, she uses it like a credit card? Dead ass, Nancy, finally. Fucking finally, she did something right. All this looks boring as hell. She finally used something the way that I thought she should use it. Why is there a big empty space in the office here? This is weird. Okay. This is one of those situations where it lets me zoom in on everything, but nothing matters, right? Oh, here we go. What's in store now for WWB Studios? Extra, extra! Rick Island leaving daytime? Manhattan, New York. Rick Island, worldwide leading daytime actor, may be in the running to play the lead role in Jocelyn Quince's upcoming thriller, Digit. WWB has refused any comment on this development, but Orleans Agency has hinted that its client is ready to break his contract with WWB. <laughs> oh, should I have gained something from knowledge from this? Hey, I'm walking here. <laughs> that part. Extra, extra, read all about it. Slick Rick, jumping ship. Hey, I'm walking here. Both sides, a lawsuit was filed for breach of agreement when he was a stint. Uh-oh, he's had legal troubles. Extra, extra, read all about it. So are you telling me that I could have... Not his wallet. Not this. Dwayne Powers, talent agent. 4377663. What's that? Oh, can I send him a fax? Six six three and then question mark? Is that a phone number? No, that's not how many letters. That's not <laughs> That's not how many, that's not how many things phone numbers have. Numbers. That says her interactive. Can I steal his money? Okay, well. Oh, wait, what was the picture of? Him and, so he's like with Maddie now. Him and Maddie are clearly a thing. I don't know if someone told me that. God, and these all... Oh my god, and some of their faces are X'd out. And some of their faces are X'd out. Dwayne Powers. 
<laughs> what am I supposed to be looking at here? I, I mean, I'd love to read the paper. I would love to pick up his suitcase. I would love to click on any of these items on his, this man's desk. But when I tell you that I cannot, and the game said absolutely not, I will tell you that I'm confused. We leave a single turd in the, in the rice box. And then there's this whole thing, and it shows me this, but I, it, I, I, I just, I just, can't, I can't even imagine what this is because I can't click on any of them. He has a cork board. He has a core. Oh, I can. Oh, I can look over a little bit, I guess. Oh, okay. I didn't know I could do that. Usually you can't zoom in and they'll still keep turning. Oh, okay. So we're back here now. No, I it's need to fine. find the key for this. Good idea. Not this. Not this. TV celebrities talk to teen girls. A panel of TV's biggest stars met with girls from around the country to discuss everything from dating to career choices. I have to go. I have to go. Explain to me why my daughter was not invited to this panel? Really? And why is Rick Arlen has better coverage than Maddie? We both know Maddie is real star show. So s someone's mad they didn't get invited to that. Enclosed is a current resume and a file photo for Teresia Popperhusen. Poppenhusen. She has 10 solid years of experience in the business. Comes to my agency with excellent references. Thank you for your attention. I can't read that. I might supposed to be am I supposed to be able to read this number that's written here? 800 561 I'm about to send a fax to the police. A fax to the police. Oh, I thought I was going to pick up the pencil so I could jab my eyes out. Okay, finally, the back of the desk. It's just, it's just, it's seven, it's seven squeeze bottles of lube. I'm sorry, what is this? Spirit gum. I'm going to New York, Rio de Janeiro. It's just... <laughs> I can't even say what I want to say. He didn't eat his fortune cookie? <laughs> Not this. Hold on. I need to scroll down. Slow Toe Jam, thank you for the six months. Yes, yes. Uh, Mickey G, thank you for the first time sub. I appreciate that. Great to have you here. Hopefully we haven't, haven't scared you off already. Uh, Kit Kat Moss, thank you for the bids. I know. What else? Oh my god, it's another doorknob. Is that another doorknob? People in this game just collect doorknobs. Oh, I know what this is. Oh, 
Am I supposed to click something after I do it? Aren't you supposed to like move the click the thing over? I thought it was four three. Oh, it's four three seven seven, not four three three seven. Okay, we got one of them. Six six three. And then we don't know. We'll just keep scrolling, I guess. Perfect. Did I grab the key? We grabbed the key. A highlighter. A check. You can't even... Oh, I thought we were going to steal the highlighter. Please be advised your account is 120 days past due. <laughs> what is this? My dental... Is this my dental... Surgeon? <laughs> is this my mail for my dental surgeon? But you have refused to return our calls. You have not made any attempts. We are seeking legal recourse. You'll be hearing from our lawyers. Okay. Final notice. Attorneys and contest marriage every claim. What are remedies? So he's in financial trouble. Rent is due. What, can I check his voicemail? Nope. I don't know who this is. This is the number he had written down, I think. Oh, I'll save here. Yeah, that's a good idea. Your call cannot be completed as dialed. We'll save it as okay. I haven't soft locked so far, which is great. And I can't. Ooh. Even, even though. It, should I know what this means? Should this mean something? I mean, it says, even though Reven should be. Dear chat, does this mean anything to me? Sh Dear chat, should this mean anything to me? Or am I over it? Killing Trolls, thank you for the bits. I appreciate that. Oh, good to hear it with the 27 months. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. Good to see you. May Morgan, thank you for the bits. Oh, no, not the voice. Miss Sanity, thank you for the five months. Good to have you here. Thank you, thank you. So, essentially, the words that don't fit, so that's what I thought. Even though, so the R doesn't fit in. Oh, it says revenge. It says revenge. Jealous, actual. So this doesn't have much meaning. Two blocks west on... Two blocks west on Scorpio. Left of the light. First right. Building on the left. Liberty Mortgage. Liberty Mutual. Can I go there? Can I drive there? Why is he writing all these numbers in red? Contact Dave Smith. David, Liberty.com. Liberty Butchual. Liberty Bibbity. <laughs> Not this. I'll call them. 555 So it's either 4311 or 9311. 555. Sure, whatever. I don't feel like I need to call them. 
It says he lies, by the way. Upside down, chat. Upside down, this says he lies. Chat? Heavy-handed metaphors in this Nancy Drew game. I hate to tell you the heavy-handed metaphors. Art, gentle, the art of gentle persuasion. Not this. Millie's number, Lillian's number, what? One, two, three, four. I don't know what this is supposed to mean. LMV. So this are all the are all the letters like a certain amount off or something? Bibbity bibbity. <laughs> If my, oh, I was going to say, if my Amazon package is delivered, I'm leaving. <laughs> Liberty, Liberty. At this point, I have so many phone numbers just written down on paper. I'll just screenshot this. This pick? Oh! Yeah, that's a tape recorder. A tape recorder, which is where the bomb was in. In fact, I did find a bomb in a tape recorder. And then I leave a single glossy turd in his office chair to let him know that he is being watched. French English Dictionary. Oh. He has a bookmark in it. Love phrases. You give me hope to carry on. Vous me donnez l'espoir de continuer. <laughs> I don't... I've never studied French before. Um. Chat? On va compter. So no meme. We will rely on each other. I think that was pretty good. <laughs> oh, I, I think that was pretty good. Not the ratatouille. Someone already told me I look like that twink from ratatouille. And I made a TikTok about it. Checkmate. I turned it into content, mama. <laughs> Checkmate. What is the viewing angle of this? It's so wild. Oh. Oh. Well, I should just go back to the studio. Taxi! Where can I take you today, miss? 1999 Broadway, please. Oh, yeah, the file cabinet. Taxi. Thank you. Yeah, what's the address? 318 West 10th Street, please. You got it. Um, GG-tastic. Thank you for all the bits. I appreciate that. Who had the pizza? Not today, thank you. Oh, no. This says I'm trouble. Ooh. Uh-oh. It wasn't Eileen. Shit. Um. Dear chat, do y'all remember who had needed a pizza? I know that it's not louder than my voice. I know that for a fact because I have a sound... Grumbly? Oh, he's grumbly. Because I have a, I have a, I have a limiter, and it can't be over negative fourteen 
negative 15 decibels. So thank you very much. I need something to make this work. And my voice can peak at negative 10 decibels. So I know it's not loud in y'all's ears. What is the truth? I need to find the key for this. Theater, right? Da, da, da. <laughs> it's... I can see the decibels that it's peaking at, and it's peaking at at, at least negative 15. My voice is peaking right now blah, 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 at negative 10. What is the truth, chat? Wait, did Nancy just say something? Did I talk over Nancy? Oof. Woof. <laughs> Not Rick Arlen canceled? Wait, he had a different name. Is that what we're supposed to be gathering from this? Call 212 home. Oh, he. we can call his home phone number. Okay. I'll leave him threatening voice messages. Doctor, what's my mother going to do? Oh, I get it. It's funny. What is the truth, chat? Should I call all these people? That's a stagehand. Oh my god. I can open just everybody's file. Oof. So we're basically, I guess we're learning that he has all of the info. So she's got a lot of Shakespeare shit. Oh my god. Um. <gasps> Nancy Drew? Have Nancy fill this out ASAP. Oh, that's funny. Yeah, I didn't even have to fill out any contract stuff. So, I don't know. Seems illegal, but I don't know. Seems illegal, but I don't know. I guess we'll call Owen. I don't know who this is. He's a stagehand. Check the address. Bamboozle Drive. New York. And I don't care about Maddie. Did I learn anything from that? Or am I stupid? Taxi. Well, hopefully well, there's more to do in there. Because I can't wait to use that buzzer again. Because I can't wait. To use that buzzer again. I was trying to brighten the light and I accidentally exposed myself. Um, whoop, Claire it is. Thank you for the bids. Good to see you. I appreciate that. Uncanny Alley, thank you for the bids too. Skybox, thank you for the bids. Dart holes in the Nancy Drew headshot. You would think. Now this is what? The door code 3689. Right door code over that. Really? That just that just fucking works just like that? That just fucking works. Okay. So I can't take his keys for some reason.
I can't even piss in his hair gel. How he does it. A day of the life of Rick Oliver. A day of the life of Rick Oliver. Mother. A day of the life of Rick Oliver. Did I not already see all this stuff? I've already broken in here before. Put a buzzer sound on the soundboard for when chat gets too rowdy. Don't give me ideas. Y'all know I love to mess with y'all. Half of the reason I like to play Nancy Drew games is because it just makes some of y'all mad. <laughs> Half the reason it just makes y'all mad. Oh, he has a tape player. I've already seen all of this stuff. We need to, I mean, where I really need to be breaking in. I'm just playing. Oh. Oh, yeah, remember when we could look in his sink? That was always fun to do, is look in his sink. I need to be going to the producers. Whoa, what is this small-ass office? Not this. Sorry, sir, it's I don't know what that is. That's a Latin or something. Password. So. Wordy. You know she writes her password somewhere. Script revision. Oh! Production files backup. Calendar backup. Not these floppy disks. Not these floppy disks. We all had these computer speakers. We all had these computer speakers too. That's the read. So if I were a password... Is this a 3D printer? No, this is just a regular printer. <laughs> From the desk there of seems to be something written on it. Bully and Vi There seems to be something oh, written on it. Oh, I understand. It's like, I need to piss on it or something. It's like, oh, the page on top of it there was seems written? seems to be something written on it. And I gotta see it from a certain angle. What if you pour oil on it? There seems to be something written on it. Uh, is this the login? Dear chat, is this the lo I would think this is the login. Should I piss on that? <laughs> we gotta find a game where piss is the answer. You're right. Call Moira Cunningham. I just picked up a pencil? Oh. Where did I get that from? Oh, you draw sideways. Yeah. Oh, so she sent the chocolates. Got it. So she's done at least one thing. Um, yet, yeah, no hint yet. There's a bunch of numbers again. Okay, so this is an early Nancy Drew game. How hard can this puzzle be? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L. A, 
A-B-C-D-E-F-G-H-R. A-B-C-D-E-F. A-B-C-D-E. Yep, that's how you do the code. The first word is life. A-B-C-D... Oh, wait, wait. That's an I. A-B-C-D-E-F-G-H-I-J-K-L-M-N-O-P-Q-R-S. Life is... <laughs> I got it. We're getting there. Life is la... This says life is like a box of chocolates. Is that what this says? Yeah, this says life is like a box of chocolates, by the way. Okay. So that's nothing I need. That's just a funny code, right? A, B, C, D, E, F, G... I can't read. Oh my god. Not anger support group. <laughs> good for her for getting help. We shouldn't, we, you know what? We should say good for her for getting help. Anger support group. Good for her. And I can't read what that says. Not my calendar leaked. Did you put it, did you try putting a diaper on it? To stop the leaking? <laughs> Will you change my diaper? <laughs> castor oil. That's why she looks like wax. She rubs castor oil on her face. What kind of maniac plug has their computer on their desk like this? What kind? She's a psychopath. Her computer tower. Will you change my diaper? Nancy once again has no reflection. Good God. I'm playing this game in 640 by 480. The spell of unknown. So this is just her like... Writing up a script, or I can't tell. We change my diaper. Oh, Mick, thank you for the 30 months, by the way. Holy cow, I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. Kick Cat Moss, thank you again for the bits. Monica, thank you for the bits. Oh, I hope class goes well. Callie Hal, thank you for the bits, too. <laughs> when the buzzer deadass goes beep. Thank you so much. And Magdalene. No, I didn't. I didn't get tickets to Trixie and Katya. But Trixie seems to make a lot of diaper jokes recently. That's partially why I do them. Will you change my diaper? I hope it was good. I wish I could have gone. Oh, my God. Oh my god, I can't read any of that. There's not enough LASIK in the world. Doesn't seem like I can click on them either. I can zoom in on her plant. Can I get the scissors? What? What is this game where I can zoom in on everything and nothing matters? What is this life? Oh my god, it's a Her Interactive Business card! Oh, from William Papa's number of instances dealing with the secret codes. Previous methods have failed. I'm putting up the bitter truth in some employees I'd hate to thank who full of revenge on a date with disaster. So, is it just me or are there a lot of italicized? A bitter hoax tainted... Look, and there are these arrows here, too, that point to them. With hate. Oh, a bitter hoax tainted with hate is a secret revenge from a previous date. So this is, this is just an Easter egg, huh? This is an Easter egg. 
I'm sniffing what they're whiffing. See, that kind of code, I get it. You know? I get it. Anger control, a self-help guide to calming violent urges. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Wait, what did this say? <laughs> Not this picture. Not this. I don't think she did the bomb, but she did the chocolates. Clearly. I need something to make this work. Oh, can I have that back? Uh-oh. <laughs> okay, I'm ready for the password hint now. Dear chat, give me a hint to get the password. Who do I think did the murder so far? I think it's been a group effort, but they're not, like, none of them each individually know they're doing it. I think he started out doing the letters. Not it's hidden in the prop room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My prediction is um, very much um, they are all doing a piece of it, but they're not working in conjunction, I don't think. I think they just all happen to independently hate him. I need something to make this work. For different reasons. What time is it? Good God, it's 3.15 in the morning. So y'all said it's what, very well hidden in the prop room? That sucks for me. Because, in fact, I'm not good at that stuff. Look over the... Pro okay, prop room logbook. Thank you. Okay. Well, I have to figure out how to get on the other side of the desk, which I'm not very good at. Oh, no, we did it. Oh, I remember this. Oh! So does this follow the same? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M. A. Oh. N. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y. Many. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P. Many P. A. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Thank you, the one person who cheered me on. Thank you, M. Rad. <laughs> G, G, Testy. Thank you for the bits again. <laughs> Not the glamour shot from Sears. Thank you so much. Ah, I don't know how many letters are in the alphabet. Do y'all know how many letters are in the alphabet? Okay, Rich. I went to public school in Arkansas. Okay. The alphabet numbered. Fucking rich people. Fucking knowing the fucking alphabet. Okay, pop off, Rich. Anyway, I found a Google image search. Now, the 19 is many pages, 13 and 5. M, E, B. Um, dear chat, do I have to know this? Dear chat, do I need to, do I need to decipher this or is this just another, like, funny, haha -ha Easter egg? No? Oh, oh, it's a hint for the password. But I, but I don't need hints, really, though. If you think about it. I might. Oh, I might actually. Mm. 
not this. Username Millie, password W W B one nine five eight. Not this. That was hard. How do you close a book? <gasps> Screaming, pissing, crying, throwing the book on the ground. Screaming, crying, running, pissing. I can go to the head writer's office? Oh no, this is... I've walked too far. I hope capitalization doesn't matter, but who knows. <laughs> Holy shit. She popped off with the custom icons. Oh. So I probably know that. Floor production list. Check all rigging grips, patent, and see- <gasps> So she was supposed to check the clamps! Get maintenance report to Papa's. Reschedule production crew. Calibrate shotgun and perambulator boom. Get extra TDC. Oh. Rick, you had no right to do that to me last night, and you deserve what you got. I've been used by you. Now I hear you're going out to LA for Jocelyn's birthday party. What is it? Y'all, what is it like being... What, these people are 40 years old. And not and still acting like you're in high school? I didn't even act like this in high school. What is going on? Are they okay? Are straight people okay? Our relationship... Well, you tell me our relationship was different. Watch your back, Rick. I just printed something. What is this? Oh! For the room upstairs! That's good to know, too. I'll take a picture with my phone. Got it. In her email. Ooh, missing props. Locate a, a beard and a mustache. Okay. A beard? <laughs> what about everyone Rick's dating? <laughs> Am I right? Ladies. Randy here for will sponsor a meeting. Thank you for your recent... Okay, so she submitted a script. Everyone was impressed. We believe your talent would be wasted. Some... <laughs> They're trying to let her down easily. They don't want to use her scripts. They said, have you considered writing fan fiction? Better control over security codes. <laughs> I'm constantly losing my decoder. We need to discuss... Oh, to Millie from Lillian. We need to discuss Rick's behavior. He's constantly late, ill-prepared. We hate him. Everybody hates him. I can't even log on to the internet. Hey, it says Blackmore. Conclusion... So this is just a deleted script. Suffering, concussion... I don't know. Let's see what's in the printer. I have to back all the way out before I... Oh my god. 
Wait, I actually cannot zoom in on this? Oh, this is his security log. Oh, this is just a, a timeline of all of... So, he gets the anonymous threat, then this happens, and this happens. Okay. Should we take this? I feel like we shouldn't leave it there for her to figure out that we just unscrambled that or whatever. Wow, there sure was a lot of stuff in here, I have to say. Very exciting, actually. Now, what was it? WWB 1958. I don't think I typed it in last time. So, what we want to really do is we want to get we want to get down with these. Thank you. Oh, thank y'all. Y'all are so sweet. <laughs> Not all of this. Kit Moss, thank you for the bits. Sometimes you just have to say the alphabet. Thank you so much. And all baby all is all of thank you so much for the bits as well. It's important to learn the alphabet, even as an adult. We are gonna stop here though. Um, but now I know how to get into the control room. I can get anywhere. Maybe I'll sabotage this place. My first sneeze in the world. Yes. I've never I've never sneezed before. We are actually going to be finishing this. Y'all. Freaking next Tuesday, a week from today, sep September 27th, I will be streaming for 6 hours. I know there's not 20 minutes left, and I'll have 6 hours to finish this game. I literally can never tell if y'all are joking. If it's 20 minutes left, Next week, September 27th, I will be doing a charity stream for six hours. I'm very excited about it. We will be playing Nancy Drew. We will be playing The Sims 4. We will be doing a lot of stuff. Well, if I finish this in the if I finish this, we'll start another Nancy Drew game. Okay? Yeah. Be there for charity. We're gonna have a lot of fun. Yeah, we'll be playing Nancy first next week. Thank you so much, Kit Kat Moss. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. So from 3 p.m. Eastern Time to 9 p.m. Eastern Time. Yeah, get your pocketbooks ready because we are going to be raising money for charity. Um, But for today, more details on that, of course, coming very soon. Coming at you very soon. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Thank you so much for being here. I'm loving this game. It sure is fun. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for all the bits, donations, subs, give subs, wonderful Patreon patrons. Y'all are freaking awesome. Um, we'll be finishing this next Tuesday. Actually, we might finish this later this week and start a new one on. Stay tuned. Check out my Twitter. We might finish this later this week. Love y'all so much. I'll see y'all Thursday regardless. Stay hydrated. Take care of yourselves. And I'll see you on Thursday on stream. Bye.